There it is, the famous fish and chips trailer in Lunenburg. Lunenburg is world famous. Worldberg, Lunenburg is world, fa world famous for making the Bounty and the Blue Nose and something else. What other boats do they make? Blue Nose 2. Blue Nose 2. Yeah, Blue. Those are two biggest things. Blue Nose 1 and Blue Nose didn't. Was there one Bounty or two? I mean, there had to be two because if there's still one now. Yeah, because the original bounty got burned up in Tahiti by the people who didn't want to go home because Tahiti was a lot nicer than anywhere else they could be working for a bunch of tyrants in England. <laughs> was it England? Probably. That's where the most tyrants are in England. Well, I know where that is. That's where the quotes are. Okay, we're not eating anything here. Is that the rule? On the Canadian dime is the blue nose. And right here in Lunenburg is the real one. Well, the real second one. The first one, I think, had the same history is the bounty. So there it is, Canada's pride and joy. Well, probably most Canadians never even heard of it. Didn't even know the blue nose was on the dime. But the Blue Nose is a schooner and it was one of the fastest ones on the planet. Maybe it still is. Dory. What's the difference between a dory and a rowboat? I'm not telling you. You have to go look it up on the internet. There you go. Blue Nose, Blue Nose Nova Scotia. Owned by the province of Nova Scotia. Launched in 1963. Crew of 18. So this is downtown Bloomberg, down at the dock. And I got other boats here too. And over there for the rich is a golf course. Forty nine meters long. I think it's about five meters wide. And it's flying the flag of Nova Scotia. That's a different boat, the Teresa E. Connor. And that's the Cape Islander. There's a tourist bus. Oh, look at they're flying the German flag over there. And that is one of the vertebrates of a whale. People that don't know that there's a Lunenburg in Nova Scotia, Canada, and a Lunenburg in Germany, and there is definitely a connection between the two. A lot of Germans like to come over to Canada, and many have settled here. People might wonder why is the blue nose black? Well the blue nose doesn't get its name from the boat color, it gets its name from the blue nose potato. If you can imagine. Blue nose potato I think is correct me if I'm wrong, native to Nova Scotia. I mean there's no such thing as a native potato in Nova Scotia, but they were brought over and made famous in Nova Scotia. Where is the potato? Native. Native to Africa? South America. It certainly isn't native to here. So this thing has cost a lot of money to maintain and there may soon be a Blue Nose 3 because this thing is slowly going to be too expensive. But there's a historic grounds coffee house. Out there's the place next door and the other place next door and that's the water hole front room where you can get food or a uh, place to sleep or some ice cream. And that's where we normally come for coffee? Well, that's normally where we go for coffee. Up here. Up there. Okay. Over there behind us what we already saw. <laughs> this is other stuff and if you're down here you can see it by looking. This is downtown Mahome Bay. Now if you want to live here you got to get rich first. There's a dory. There's a dory. Well, I don't know if that's good for something but there it is. Hunky dory on well, that's really clever.
And the story on the churches is every time a drunk sailor got out in a storm, he promised God to build a church if he took them home safely. So some of them got home safely, and there's lots of churches and chapels. Because quite often the waters get rough out there. You should not believe anything anybody tells you. So, <laughs> don't believe my mother when I'm when she says I'm trying to tell you to believe something. But I appreciate that she's being part of the video. It's always good to have a second opinion. But that was the story. That's the the that's the worst room. The seamen merchants built them all. Toes it says for a season. What? No, no peeing. Wash your clothes for a season. Yeah. Well, you clothes and wash them. Well, you walk on a street to your station. Oh, I forgot to do the churches. Oh, there goes one behind us. There's one. Oh, there's another one. There's another one. Oh, there's another one beside it. One that, if they don't build the ships better, we'll have the whole place full of churches. And over there is where we're going to eat. Standing is beside us. We're not going there. We're going right here. That's in that cafe, and they get some really excellent fish. And if we exclude that little pole, you get a nice panorama view of all the churches in Mahome Bay. I don't know if anybody goes there, probably a little bit more than some towns. Conservative towns always have more people going to church because they think that's conservative and nice and safe. Everybody wants to be safe much happening today because it's too cold, but in another month this place will be packed. Well, there's another one of those places probably built by some sailor that was... Well, I won't get into that. Another story on the, um, the schooner is that it was built as a res racing schooner, and later the merchants took it over and shipped stuff and it wasn't burnt, it was sunk in a storm somewhere in the Caribbean or the Caribbean, depending on how you like to say it. Some like potatoes, some like potatoes, some like Caribbean, and some like Caribbean. Bank of Montreal. Families, those were all the mafiosos that came over. No, it wasn't. What was it again? Who knows? Doesn't matter. Founded families, as if it matters. You can get ice cream in here or food. Does that mean ice cream isn't food? Not really. Doesn't matter. Anyway, that's a save easy. There's some little boats.